Welcome to the blue room. Yes, it's blue instead of green. We are, of course, in our attic room. Yeah. And we wanted to share the colour. And it's far from being finished, but we are now. We are so happy with it now. Yeah, it looks really, really good. Yes, we went for feral and ball, low with blue, which, Yerk, comes from from the beautiful shade oh. of, of the sea yeah. at Lulworth Cove in Dorset. Yeah, and it looks really like the sea. It, yes, it's beautiful. It's, um, I would say, it looks wonderful when the sun is out, yeah. but also when it's dark. Yeah. It's wonderful. So, um, I don't know, I was going to say, let, um, let us give you a tour, but that would be... A bit of an exaggeration. Yeah, but give him a tour. <laughs> so, this is the colour. So, you already know the the door that we painted in uh, York. That was a little green paint. Yeah. And this is the blue now. Absolutely wonderful. We love that. We love it so, so much. And Jörg already painted the, the door as well, which will go here. This is um, a bit of storage space. And we, of course, will change the switches and sockets. And here yeah, this morning we had a very special delivery. Yes, we got our office table. Yeah, which is actually it's quite simple. We will show you probably tomorrow morning. Yeah. And it's from Habitat, but it was the best solution because we can get it up here. Yes, we can as assemble and disassemble it. Yes, exactly. And although it's quite simple, we said. It is completely, yeah. it's timeless, and we just make it look more beautiful. And with, it's not too big. Yes. And we said we want to make it look a bit more beautiful with accessories, yeah. fabric, stuff like that. And we also, so we will show you in a second, um, this won't be painted because we will have fitted cupboards in yeah. there. Yeah. Planning to have yes, on on both sides, and we also plan on having a shelf here, a bookshelf. So we looked for inspiration on Pinterest for the cupboards, and they should look like this, but not just a bit more beautiful. Like this is just an idea, but they should look like this then yeah so and um, for the for the shelf we we couldn't find the exact same shape but something like this just as an inspiration with a sort of a i don't know frame yeah jerk. yeah so something like this this is what we have in mind and um, we are currently measuring everything and are getting in touch with a joiner to get a quote. So it just should have a a frame. And we also think this looks so nice with the with the new carpet yeah. now. Yeah. It's a really nice combination. Yeah the room looks totally different now. Yeah. And uh, some areas need another code but we ran out of paint and are currently waiting for a new pot, so I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. We might put the desk here. We will see. We will see once it is assembled. So here's our desk waiting to be assembled, which we will do tomorrow morning. This is why we can't have an antique table, sadly, yeah. but... Jörg is getting hot because he carried the, I was going to say, um, table. Yeah, yeah it, is ta it is a table. Dear me. 
You know what I thought? If we're lucky, although I thought it was Monday today, which is completely wrong, um, maybe we will get the second um, pot from Fair and Ball. So maybe we can paint tomorrow. I don't know. What do you think? We'll see. Do you need help, Jörg? No. This is the current situation with our non-existing light. We ordered a light fixture from Jim Lawrence. We really love that brand. We have several um, lights from them, also in our guest bedroom. And we ordered the light fixture, I think, three days ago. And hopefully it will arrive soon. Kirsten? Yes? Need your help. Okay. The idea to paint it in the color, in the color of the wall yeah. is great. Yes. So whoever gave us the idea, because I don't know the name, Thank you very much. I, 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 sadly, I no. don't remember the yeah, name. But it either. was a great idea. Yeah. It looks wonderful. Yes. And once the knob is changed, you know what I really, really, what I love a lot is the colour of the door. Yeah. Because it always makes me realise how many different shades of white there are. I don't, Yuck, do you... <laughs> I just don't remember. Is it that one? Pig. This is the colour actually, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So this is the colour of the door. Little green, pig, intelligent eggshell. And this by the way is the colour of the of the blue door. Yeah. So lower blue and that's a state eggshell. And it looks wonderful together. Yeah. I I think the door, the white, is so yeah. it's warm. Yeah. It's just stunning. The rooms totally change. Yeah. Oh, let's have a look. As we are basically back in lockdown here in our county, uh, I don't know, we have to check. Do you think that the recycle centre is closed as well? I believe. Because last time it was open, so I don't know. I think in tier four it's closed. Yeah, all mm. non essential. Yeah. Okay. So we went back into. We went into tier four last, uh, I think, they, no, this week, which is basically very similar to lockdown. And it's not for all of the UK, but large parts of the UK are in uh, tier four now. So, this looks so small. This looks so small. <laughs> I know, okay. No. I was confused for a second. <laughs> It is a very, very simple desk that will take over this room. And um, we knew that, of course. It's not too big because that was something we didn't want a huge table in here. Yeah. And it is very, very simple. Yeah. So it's usually we would have gone for a for an antique table, definitely. But um you said that in uh, in German you was you said it looks a bit like a 
a felt, a felt tish. Yes. Like. Um, let's say a kind of simple desk which we used in the army. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. If you look into. Definitely. Let's say how. Yeah. In the 19th or century, the armies had work, they had this kind of simple desk. Because yeah. You could easily assemble and disassemble it. Yes. Yeah. Very and, true. And that's what I like. Yeah. It will look nice once there's a, a little lamp and with a chair, I hope. Yeah. And it gives us enough space for other stuff in yeah. here, maybe to two nice chairs, yes. something like that, where we can chill. And until we get the proper chair, we will put a very simple dining chair up here. Yeah. Yeah, for the, for the time being. And we'll, we will see how we will arrange this room later. We don't know yet. We'll see. So, this is the desk and it has two little drawers as well. And the name of the desk, hang on, is... I don't know where the instructions are. Um, well, here's the name. Roscoe. Not sure about the pronunciation, but you see it here. Oh! <laughs> yeah, you brought the pillow. You brought the pillow. This is a pillow that we bought in France at Chateau Chambord, I think. Oh my God, it's a bit dusty. Yeah. Chateau Chambord at the Loire Valley. It's good for the time being. Well, now you can pretend to work. <laughs> okay. You think it will work? Yeah. We'll have to wait and see where to put things. Good. Yeah. <laughs> so, Kirsten, what do you think? No, I think it's fine. It's fine. It will do. It's not a huge table, but yeah. um, it suits the room probably. Can I take a message? Can I take a message? Do you want me to book a table? Yes, Lady Penelope. <laughs> well, I'm asking whether you want me to book a table, but uh, we are basically in lockdown. We just bought a table, so we don't need to book a table. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Uh, when you say Lady Penelope, what's the name of her? Parker. It's Parker. 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 We're talking about Thunderbirds, in case you haven't watched that. One of Jörg's favourite childhood series. Yeah. I and love it. It is really good. It's really good. Yeah. We should watch it again. It's just yeah. fun. Yeah. Well, it's, um, we are, I don't know, we are adding bit by bit. It's very yeah. slow. It is what it is. Well, the drawers are pretty small. Tiny. Good morning. I'm so glad because I actually made an effort today and put on some real clothes and, well, the opposite of casual, which feels quite nice from time to time. And while we were sat at the breakfast table this morning, Jörg and I decided to finally go through some of our frames and pictures that we had in Germany and that we have never used in the UK and we've had them for ages and most of them are still packed and yeah we just want to have a look at them after almost five years and we thought we would share what we have and yeah because most of them have lots of memories so maybe I don't know we thought it would be fun to share yeah so, as you can see, a lot of them are still unpacked. 
one. Should we start with the one in the middle? Because yeah. it's it's unpacked already. And that's a Shakespeare print that um, I bought at in in London at the at the Globe. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so that was while I studied in Cambridge and I know I, I remember when I bought the print yeah. and I it was my wish to have it framed and I got it as a Christmas present from my parents and my sister. Yeah. So I put it on my board. And that's a special kind of coating. Yes. And it was in your office. In it Germany. was, it was. And well, for for those of you who have just joined our channel, um, I studied English literature and um, part of my studies um, happened in Cambridge, which was amazing. And this is very, very special. So we will see where to put it. Um, yeah. Lovely. Yeah. Very, very special. And I think this one is very special for you, Jörg. Yeah. And this is what we actually may have some value. You think that has got a value? Yes. Yeah. Because it's, it's old. Mm -hmm. It's from my great, great, great grandfather. And oh, the glass is broken. Yes. Well, we had a feeling that the glass is probably broken. So we have to go somewhere. Yeah and get that fixed, or not fixed, replaced, replaced. So this is from your great-great-grandfather. Yes. And it's... Uh, oh, you know what we forgot? There's something that, something comes with it, a pipe. A pipe and a mug. A mug as well. Yes, hang on. There's and a bit of... from 1900. This is yeah. amazing. I love the colours. Yes. So we have it's to... Get some glass. And then we'll have to just reframe it. Do you think you should um, get the, the big mug and the pipe to show it together? Yes. What do you think? Hang on, guys. <laughs> yeah, we'll fetch it. So this is a pipe. Wow. Oh. That's really antique. Yes, it's from 1900. And who got this? My... N n I mean, like, soldiers back yes. in the day. Yes, because at that time, mm -hmm. the, uh, the German army was... You know, they had to, to go to the army. Yeah. And at yeah. the end of their term, yeah. they got this as a present and as a kind of remembrance. Right. So they got a picture, a pipe, and a mug. Can you show me the pipe again? I think I've never... Yeah, it's really seen. nice. Yeah. And it's been used, you can see. It's been used. Yeah. yeah so it, it wasn't for decoration. So they That's used really it. special. And the mug. And the mug. The only thing, the mug um, has to be repaired because it's broken here. Oh, okay. But look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think that can be fixed. Yes. What does that say in German? Um, Kanonendonner ist unser Groß. Oh my God. Cannon fire is our greeting. I'm not sure. <laughs> right. Oh, Donner is thunder, so it's yeah. cannon thunder is our greeting. I don't know. And here is like, this is... The Kaiser. Yeah, Kaiser Wilhelm. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm not 100% sure. I think this is the Bavarian king. Yeah. And this is the king of Württemberg. <laughs> because you can see, this is the, 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 the signs. That's uh, because these are the signs of the German Germans. And this is Bavaria. This is Württemberg. And this is Prussia. So this is the only probably most valuable yes. thing. Yes. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Let's continue. But it's nice. This is very, very nice. Yeah. What we sometimes do is when we travel somewhere nice, 
we buy prints and then get them framed afterwards so we have a nice memory. It's, I don't know, it's really, really nice. We enjoy that so much and we have some of, um, some of the prints we bought actually here in the UK long before we moved here. <laughs> I think they are 20, 25 years old probably. Yeah. And this is a print that shows London. Yeah, because you can see St. Paul's. St. Paul's. Yeah. And it must be in the 30s. It's nice. It's still nice. Yeah. This is something from Sweden, Stockholm. actually. We bought them in Stockholm. Yeah. 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 Because this is a marketplace in Stockholm. And this says... And um, that's the main main station in Stockholm. And pretty obvious, we love old stuff. Yeah, because that's from, <laughs> so the picture was taken 1910 and yeah. this is 1920. And I think, um, judging by the frames over there, these are the ones that we bought um, while we spent a holiday in Wales, yes. I think. Yeah. yeah, yeah, Conway, North Wales, Conway. Yeah, I love this picture. Yeah, this is lovely. But, you know, I think that was, although we had a holiday cottage in, uh, in Wales, didn't we buy them in Chester? We bought them in Chester, yes. Yeah. And we bought them framed, I remember. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And the place still exists, yes. by the way. Yes. It still exists. And it's so funny because whenever we, whenever we look at these pictures and uh, we have to think of Chester and when we visited Chester, I don't know. This is, no, that's not 20 years ago. Probably, probably about 12 years ago. Yeah. Yeah. And... We visited Chester and we said, what a beautiful little city. And now we live 20 minutes from Chester. Who would have thought? Sometimes life is really, really strange, isn't it? Yeah. Really, really strange. We don't really know what this is, but I have a feeling. Oh, yes. Now I can see it. Yeah. This is from our parents. Yes. That's a picture from Vincent van Gogh. Yes. And um, I remember now that my parents went to Amsterdam and visited the Van Gogh Museum yeah. and bought two prints and then had it framed as a Christmas present. So yeah. this is it's very, oh, very this. special. We could never give it away. Never. Mm -hmm. And this is the other one. Yes. So, to give you. And they're really nice. They are still nice. And we both had them in our main bedroom in Germany. Yes. And now we are really, we're thinking about where to put what, so. And this is just, although these aren't obviously not the original Van Gogh paintings, they are very, very special and have, they don't have a value because they are so, so special. So, well, at the end of the day, they have a huge value for us. Memories, because they're from your parents. Yes. And we've, all, and we've also been in Amsterdam in the Van Gogh. Museum. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was a wonderful, yeah. wonderful visit. Together with some friends. In, uh, in case you haven't seen Amsterdam, it's beautiful. It's so, so beautiful. Very, very special, isn't it? Yes. We've been twice and we loved it so it's much. really nice. I haven't got a clue. We, I know we bought that in England. Yeah. Uh, I think we bought them in London. Maybe, at, the, yeah. at the museum. Yeah. Probably the National Gallery, wasn't it? I'm not sure because we've got some pictures here. That need to be framed. 
that need to be framed. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, and these were bought in the National Maritime Museum. Yeah, and I think I'm not a hundred percent sure. That's the other one. Yeah. That's still beautiful. We have to have them framed. Yes. And because that's Tarbridge and that's Lord Nelson. Yeah. As a young captain. Beautiful. This one. And Do you know where we bought it? Well, obviously in Manhattan. Yes, we did. <laughs> we bought it in New York. Do you know where exactly? Because I don't know the shop. My God, yeah. why don't I remember this? Yeah. Doesn't it say? It says Studio Manhattan. <laughs> I, I really don't know. Can't I nice don't know. But we love Manhattan. Yeah. And it's a really nice picture. Yeah. Another one to be framed. Yeah. What have anyway. you got over there? This is, oh, uh, well, we have some. I don't know. They're probably not that nice. No, I want. I meant the other one. These are nice. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> this one. Yeah. yeah. Well, this is just. This is not particularly beautiful or anything. But it's a wonderful memory. Yeah. Because that's Cambridge. Yes. And yeah, that's. I bought these while I studied at Cambridge, and I remember, I. I uh, made a very, very special friend there, Leslie from the States, and we are still friends. And I bought the frames with her, the cards, the prints, and yeah, I don't know where to put. We had these in our bathroom in Germany. I think this one, I don't know. These oh, yes. Living yeah. room. No, in the hallway, actually. In the hallway, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, the other ones you've got over there, this is just, they are antique prints. Antique prints. Did I, did I give them to yeah, you as a, a present? That, yeah, that's a Christmas present. Um, and they're old because they're from... Does it say? Yeah, 1860 to 1890, so yeah. they're 130 years old. Okay. And they're British flags, you can see. <laughs> yeah. As if we knew what was going to happen yeah. years later. And, <clears throat> sorry, we have, I think, three more left. <laughs> yeah. So I hope it's okay to share. Um, yeah, because this is, it's special for us. And we thought we would share it with you because we haven't really looked at these pictures in years, you know. I have no clue. This time I honestly don't have a sink. Is that? I know what it is. It's a really special one. This, it's Oscar Wilde, isn't it's, it? It's not, yeah. It's From the era. Yeah, it is. That was in my office. Yes. So Jörg just opened something that is beautiful and so so special and this is it because i wrote my master thesis on oscar wilde and his comedies i fell in love with the art used in some of his works and this is this is an illustration that was used in a in a work or in a play yeah, called Salome. Salome. So this is the one which I I just love this style. So, and this is by the same artist, I think Beardsley. Yeah. His, name, his name is Beardsley, and there was a a magazine called the Yellow Book yeah. in the eighteen nineties, and huh, it's a bit difficult with the sun. I think. Yeah. Well, you get an idea. Jörg and I just love this style so much. Very, very special. We have to think about where to put all of these. Yeah. And that's the last one. Yeah. Here, yeah, that's the last one. Oh, we've got another one. Yes. Which was in our dining room in Germany. I... And it's also a fun memory we have. 
Oh, yeah. <laughs> of course, King's College. King's College. In Cambridge. In 1830. Can you hold it? <laughs> and Cambridge, by the way, is always worth a visit. It's beautiful and very special to us. But we really love Oxford as well. Oxford is beautiful. Cambridge is a little bit smaller, probably. Yeah. And it's just, I, I don't know, we love both. But Cambridge, of course, is very special because I studied there at least for a little while. So now we have to decide where where to put everything. Yeah. We talked about creating a gallery wall in our snug ab above the, the sofa. Yeah. So we'll probably use some of them. Yeah, but first we want to have another, a, a, a new sofa. And the other ones? Yeah, or well, maybe use them in the hallway. Maybe in the hallway or in the master bedroom. But well we will see and you will you will see you will see it as well. It's a bit difficult up here because we don't really have walls. We don't really have walls, which is a shame because some of them would look so nice with the blue paint. Yes. I would like to put up our maritime themed pictures here. Yeah, yeah, definitely. By the way, we didn't get the paint yesterday, so we will probably have to finish painting yeah. this room next week. Yeah. And since we are basically on lockdown again here, where we are in this county, Cheshire, we have to create home contents. <laughs> we have no other choice. No, so not a lot to travel. No, we hope it's okay. And Probably this week will just be one video because we will try to to um, plan our content. And again, thank yeah. you so much for watching. Yeah, and take care of yourself. Yes. Stay we, safe. We have to say we were so happy that you enjoyed our New Year's Eve video. Yeah. We didn't expect it, to be honest, because we <laughs> we just thought we would film away and just I don't know, just share, so it made us so happy that you enjoyed it, right? Yeah. <laughs> and until next time, and see you again very soon. Yeah, stay safe. Stay safe. So, bye-bye. Bye-bye.